welcome back. I'm not sure this video is going to be in, in sturdy with the other video that I already did today or not. Um, so yeah, I did not vlog the uh, Sam Club thing. Y'all, it's hot as hell out here in Florida. It's hot. I'm literally sweating. I'm out of breath. I'm hot. I'm running around trying to get the stuff for the house. For um, you can see some of the stuff I got back there: birthday cake, juices. I got stuff up here: food, groceries. Tomorrow is Destin's birthday, um, which is the 11th. So by the time you see this, it will be past his birthday because I have three or four vlogs already to have to post before that. But I probably do. I probably do do. do I can't even talk, guys. It's so hot. It's hot. Um, I'll probably do like a little short clip that, that they have on YouTube called Shorts, which just can't be no longer than one minute, which you guys get a lot from me actually. <laughs> so, um, I couldn't get a cake provided the way I wanted to, because the little short notice, I didn't, I forgot, but I did not forget. I knew it was birthday, but I forgot. Oh, forgot to get, I have to get him a cake. He's finna turn 13. The big. 13 can be a teenager but Vaughn you know most bo most boys not aren't mature which is good um, and, and bad but my son isn't mature in the way as far as he's still a child like I want him to be he's still a little boy who doesn't you know think about all that craziness he may cross his mind but he doesn't act like that at all he still like to play video games watch cartoons all this other stuff like that so that's the good part about it. Like we did when we were growing up. Like we as kids did growing up at 13, you know, whatever. So but anyway, um I couldn't find no theme which I y'all you know, think 13 or should have themes on a cake? I don't I don't know. I'm just going I'm just learning as I go. Um be the best mother I can be. That's all I can do. Um so, with that being said, I couldn't find the cake I wanted for him, like a nice theme cake. So, and most, most people can't, most of them, they, they don't do Disney and other themes because it's copyrighted. It's copyrighted and they get in trouble for it, so public kind of cut that out. So, what I did was I bought my own cartoon characters. I saw them inside of uh, Dollar Tree and I just purchased um, despicable me and the people cutting the girl that was trying to get her to write on the cake for Destin <sighs> she was like she's not the, the decorator whatever it's gone for the day it's 3 o'clock what do you mean it's 3 o'clock but she's gone for the day so I'm going to have to write on the cake which is not a problem because I bought despicable me characters and if you know the, which are the minions you know, they always called in trouble and drama and I was being bad. The minions thought they're like the little the devil's little helper. So what I'm going to do, I'm gonna write happy birthday destined on there, but I'm gonna kinda I'm pretty sure it's not gonna be perfect or whatever. So I'm gonna kinda have the minions mess it up. I'm gonna kinda decorate them. I'm, I'm trying to think about doing it on camera. So which means I'm gonna have to do it tomorrow. So I wanna try to do that and have like have it them mess it up in a way so it look like they did it and they be like ta da because I want different kind of little minions to go on there so they basically messed up Destin cake so no harm no foul either way it doesn't matter because I, I don't have those type of children that get mad at certain type of things get or very picky like that you know they are very appreciative of what they have and what they don't have they don't miss it because they never how can you miss something you never had so yeah, and on top of that, school's gonna be out at the end of the month, so they don't need no shoes. Uh, brand new shoes, no, you don't need that. Summer's coming, so yeah, trying to get like little water activities at the house. And on my weekends, off of that, what I get once a, uh, once a month, I get a weekend off. Um, I'm gonna try to go somewhere. Oh crap! I 
I'm gonna take the curb. And and to the people that uh, I wanna people what is people, what I went this way for? Did I go this way to get something to eat? Cause I am quite hungry. Mm. What is there to eat? All this stuff. I don't want checkers. That Moe's restaurant right there is dirty to me. Very, very dirty to me. Um, what's up here? Mm, nothing but McDonald's is up here. Maybe I just go all the way through town. I'm not in no hurry. I'm off today, by the way. So, um, so yeah. Lloyd's Willing, I put an application at a, um, at another job. I'm going to, since I have my certificate um, at um, MedTech, I'm going to go ahead and try to put that to good use. And, uh, yeah, there's a lot of places hiring for that. And, you know, so. And then my next thing I'm going to start working on is working on the phlebotomy like a three to four month plus I think I'm sorry wrong was calling so give me a minute and I'll be back okay you guys I'm out of public I need to find my cleaning wipes so I can clean my hands I bought me a chicken tender club sandwich whatever from Publix I never get them never ever I'm a turkey Turkey bacon girl and rum. I always got the chicken tender. What it called? Chicken tender. And I got it. <coughs> I was terribly thirsty. I bought these Mardi Gras wings. These are the big old turkey tent or chicken tender sandwich. But I think I'm gonna save that for me and hubby because that's huge and. That's one of his favorites, but he got to get buffalo, buffalo ranch or whatever on it. And no, ma'am, not me. Not me. Got me some nice pineapples, though. Nice pineapple. Mm. Not super sweet. Got a little tartness to it. That means it wasn't all the way right. Let me cut it. This is fine with me. Then I got their Mardi Gras wings. Very good. I like to put them in an air fryer though. Make, to make mine more crispier and they be so tender till they fall off the bone like some of them are now Let me show. you see how some of them are falling off the bone like this one they're so tender and they're so nice looking so yeah so anyways back to me Don't even have to bite. I'm gonna just suck it right now. Mm -hmm. mm. This is a bone breaker. little spicy but that's okay but that's okay I'm full you know why 
because I've been, I've been snacking. Not in this video, but the video you guys will see. I've been snacking on them, them Asian snacks and drinking and all that compound made me full. But I'm never too full for seaweed. Never who will for that. That was good. That was good. So, but anyway, like I would tell you, before, when, before Rome call, I applied for a job position to put my certificates, you know, well, you don't know. I don't know if you know that, but I'm a certified med tech now. And my aunt that came, my auntie wanted to call a long time subscriber, you guys know, know her. She's a she's a nurse also and she worked down south in the hospital and with mama Sharon she worked in the hospital as well and she was like why won't I start using it don't just let it sit around whatever so I put an application in an application in so therefore with that I can I could just sit with old people I can work with what the position I apply for, I can do a lot of things. So I just don't have to do that. That's a lot of things I can do with this med check. I can post my certificate in this video and um, it'll show you what all I can do. Um, before the year's out, I want to have to have these goals. Before the year's out, I want to start working on my uh, phlebotomy. So, I could just take blood. So, yeah. He's time for a change, you guys. Oh, no, I was talking to him about this. I forgot, too. Um, there was a subby that's like, do we ever travel outside of Florida? Yeah, we travel outside of Florida. But me, I'm not going too far from home with my kids. So if something happens, no, I'm not that person. And me, I'm not going to put my children in harm's way or go anywhere out of state. It's basically the time to do it. Florida is one of the greatest states. Florida has the most beautiful beaches in the United States. Why the fuck will I go anywhere else? There's so many beaches in Florida I haven't even traveled to. And I'm trying to hit up everyone before I die. You know what I mean? I'm trying to go to Key West and all this. The Florida Keys, you know, all these beaches, beautiful beaches. Like there are some hidden ones. Sarasota was it's not Sarasota. It's Santa something. I'm in this Florida group, so it's like I see all these beautiful beaches I want to go to. The most beautiful beach I have saw so far is Destin. The water, the sand. Everything is amazing. My kids are not all into all that shit that y'all might be all into when we want to go to a state. No. 
for she had for the experience after we had little words. You know? Like Vegas. Who the fuck take their kids to Vegas? My children are literally still kids. Why would I take them to Vegas? What can they do in Vegas? Not a damn thing. I'm not taking them no damn Vegas. New York. What the fuck take them to New York? It's a crowded fucking place. Oh, you gotta walk basically everywhere. They don't have no type of things that they have here for them to play with. No theme parks, no all this other stuff that they like to do. No. You don't know my kids, you don't know what they like. Or nine times out of ten, it'd be their decision where they want to go. LA, that would never fucking happen. Because I'm not taking them on a plane. If I can't drive there within the maximum is six, seven hours, I'm not doing it. Especially if I know I only have like maybe two to three days off during that one time. Why would I take a whole day to travel to another state? On a plane without that mother, they have to come back with less than 24 hours. This dumb as fuck. So if you don't know my schedule, you don't know my kids' schedule, you don't know my life, just shut the fuck up. Shut up. Just, just shut up. Just shut up. Sit back and watch the video. If you don't want to watch the video, don't watch the video. If you want to watch the video, watch the video. I know what I'm doing it for. I know what I have to do it for. I know my time frame. That's some ungrateful bitches. Not all y'all, but you know who, you know who I'm talking about. So, you damn TV so good. I love that. So, y'all just like, beyond me with that bullshit. Like, what the fuck? Y'all don't know me in real life. You don't know my life. You don't know my kids. You don't know my family. You don't know what my job is. My job schedule is as far as you know my, my way at work. But you don't know what my how many days my time off. And then if I do, my kids cannot be out of school all them days. If I if I want to take off more. No, that's that's preposterous. That's who kind of mother you might be. But yeah, not me. Education comes first. Bye. Let me worry about my Campbells. And you worry about your family. I am always going to do what's best for mine. And what makes them happy, it makes me happy. So if they want to go to Orlando a hundred times, what are you going to do? You go to Orlando a hundred times. And I'm going to record them a hundred times. But the thing y'all felt to forget failed to mention my, or realize about Orlando. Orlando was super, super, super fucking huge. There's no way you can travel and see all the great spots of Orlando in a day. Two, three days at that. Four days at that. It's huge. All these amazing restaurants I want to go to. I didn't get a chance to go to. Uh, it's like, oh my god. All the hidden treasures and bars and stuff. Uh, and half of the stuff I want to do is, is not kid friendly. So... Get on TikTok and type in Orlando, Florida. Just type in Orlando, Florida. And see all the stuff that pops up. You can never be able to travel all that. See all those things. Even in a week's time either. So. And my kids, in a way, they just want to hang by the pool. So I'm going to have to stand. But me and Ron, we're going to go. I wanted to go to DJ Cali restaurant. It didn't get a chance to go there. I was supposed to see my girlfriend Ashley. My sis Ashley. You know her. Full fear of life. I didn't get a chance to do that because it was forgot. I was my fault a little bit. I forgot. And then it was like I got the kids with me. Cool. We was going to do some really cool shit. You know. Picnic on beach and shit. I love her. In Orlando I try my best to make let her know I'm there so I can see her before I go. Got caught up this time with the kids. That's why I go by myself. I know for a full fact, I will see her my little tea up. So, that's my girl. And I love Ashley so much. She's so positive. She's like one of them friends that you ain't got to talk to every day, but you always can pick up where you left off at. Just when you're there, you're there, you connect it, you just, boom, you know. And then she's like what type of person that like pushes you like to better yourself as far as you, yourself, your business. And she know I'm like a clothing shell, so she tried to get me to go out and do different things like travel. 
you know, out of, out of the country. She knew what I'm talking about. I'm like, I wanted to go so bad, babe. I swear to God. I wanted to go. I was scared. I was nervous all the way. But I had so much shit to do. But, I said at the beginning of this year, 40 years out, I'm going to get on a plane. Even if that is to get on a plane and fly to somewhere a short distance, because I'm scared. Fly a sh short distance, like maybe Miami, it was like an hour and a half, around 45 minutes, maybe to Miami, something like that, and just fly back. But, yeah. But I really love her because she really pushes me. She motivates me. She makes you want to do better. That's the kind of people you need to have around you and in your circle. You don't need negative people in your circle. You don't need nobody to make you feel bad or whatever the case that may be. You need somebody that's going to make you feel good, push you. Because when one do good, the other does good. You, you want to see your friends to see. You know what I mean? You want to see them go places and do things. So. Get you somebody like an Ashley. Get you an Ashley. Now, all Ashley's aren't good Ashley's. But that Ashley is a good Ashley. Yeah, I was like, hey, with how many TVs you gonna eat? Baby, I don't know these things. And they have like no carbs in it at all. Mm. Only 25 calories a, a pack. And they help me go to the bathroom too. No more for now. But well, yeah, that's about it. Thank you for watching. And you no. Know, sticking with me and hooks to the video so comment like subscribe comment on anything you hear like that you want to talk about that you heard in the video and i will see y'all soon or you'll see me soon you know comment below any videos you'd like to see or want to see i know you guys say hey, whatever you post we're gonna watch so i thank you for that too but you know just in case you want to see something so i'll see you later